Hi everyone, welcome to Leposcopus. Thank you so much for being here. Today we are doing a reading for Libra. This is going to be from now until the end of May. Let's go ahead and check the energies and see what comes through, what we need to know, what's happening for you Libras. I apologize for being a little late for these readings. I usually do them mid-months. But we still have some time left in May, so let's go ahead and see what's going on. Hmm. Walking away. Walking away comes through right away for you. I think Virgo also got that energy. You must be you might be on the cusp of Virgo and Libra. You might have a lot of Virgo in your chart. So if you're interested, check out that reading as well. We also have fifth chakra, Archangel Gabriel, and door to value. Okay, let's go ahead and start clarifying. Starting with a walking away. What is that here for Libra? Mm. Some of you could be walking away from a marriage. Some of you could be walking away from a marriage with a Sagittarius here. Going through legal separation. And I feel like um, you could be, once you walk, th once you walk away from this marriage, once you go through the, um, you know, the separation process, legal separation, uh, separating your assets and everything that's connected to this marriage, I feel like there will be a new love coming your way. This is your card right here. Justice is your card, your presentation, Major Arcana. You're doing what's right for you. This is a very strong message for you. And this is just a reminder that there is love available for you. There is new love available for you. So if you're walking away from a relationship that was toxic, um, from a relationship that just didn't work out, this could have been a marriage that just did not work out. It's not no longer something that uh, fulfills you. It's no longer something that's right for you. And I do feel that uh, you're walking away from that. You're doing what's right for you. And yes, there's absolutely new love on the horizon for you after this. Let's go ahead and clarify this fifth chakra into Gabriel. Page of materials. Queen of Emotions, the Devil, Five of Voices. Wow, Ten of Voices and Five of Swords. There is a need here to speak up. There is a need uh, here to speak your truth. There is a need here to say what you need to say here. And I do feel that for a lot of you, this is in romantic love. This is in some sort of relationship where there is so many fights. There are so many arguments. Uh, there is an energy here of being left alone. And there is an energy here of leaving someone alone and ending a relationship. I do get the energy of ending a relationship that was toxic. There was, uh, there was manipulation here. There were a lot of fears connected in this union here. You could have been dealing with somebody who's really um, uh, not great with their money. I feel like this person have a, having a lot of financial issues here. There could have been a, a romantic connection here where you know you had a lot of love for this person, but in reality, in the, um, actual life, it just wasn't working out. I feel like this person was quite manipulative. There were, uh, there could have been even an energy here where they were manipulating you for money. I'm getting that energy strongly here as well. And it's time for you to speak the truth. It's, it's time for you to hear the truth, to understand the truth, and also say what you need to say. Speak your truth. I do feel that there is a conflict here, and I do feel that you will overcome this conflict, but yet you will leave this person. You're leaving, you're moving away. You don't want to be, you know, continuously arguing with them. You want to put an end to these uh, arguments and continuous fights by walking away. That's what I'm getting there. Interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and clarify this door to value. What is that all about? What's this for Libra? Some of you are worried about finances and where the next money is coming from, where the next paycheck is coming from, where the next influx of finances is coming from. But I do see a great progress there. 
Um, some view this um, there is a, an opportunity opening up. There is an opportunity opening up for you. For a lot of you, this is um, I'm getting an energy of performers, somebody who's on the stage, somebody who's in public eye, and it's like curtains and veiling, and there is money coming in for you. You're in a spotlight here. There is a lot of attention on you. You could be growing your following, especially for those of you who are working in some sort of uh, some sort of social media. If you're on a, some sort of platform here, or even if you're on the stage, I feel like you're becoming more famous more accepted more popular here uh, you're definitely becoming a star you're you are standing out in the crowd here and it is bringing you financial independence but that are nine of inspiration you've been persevering you've been working really hard yes you've been worried about your finance like I said it's almost like a worry about where the next money the sum of money is coming from that's ending for you there is a glow up here you're becoming the star that you're meant to be and your finances are going to stabilize here. You will be much more assertive in your career, much more present. Your presence will be much more powerful in whatever that you do here, whatever field you're working in. And there is absolutely more money coming in for you. Beautiful energy there. I like that. Hmm, becoming a star, huh? All right, let's go ahead and um, let's pull some Coffee Cup Oracle cards for you and let's see what else we need to know from now until the end of May. Okay, that was quick. I'm getting this energy here of you um, not being appreciated for who you truly are, not being appreciated for the gem that you truly are. This could have been in your previous relationship and that's what's changing for you. You're done with that. You're leaving that relationship. You're freeing yourself from it. You could have been quite... Um, there's almost this energy of depression in this relationship. Like you were not recognized. You were not valued. And I feel like you're cutting them off. You're cutting them out, Libra. This is your energy. This is an air sign. But it's also somebody who's cutting people out of their lives who are not supposed to be there any longer. Yeah, you're, you're disconnecting. You're going into a soldier here. Um, five of swords. Uh, absolutely, there could be arguments connected to this for sure. I feel like you stopped talking to this person. This could have been somebody you were married to. This could have been somebody that you were in a long-term relationship with and you are ending it there is an ending of relationship oh yes there is absolutely an ending of relationship you're doing what's right for you you're comfortable being on your own you don't have to be connected you you don't need to be in this energy of codependency here you're very comfortable of being on your own you're freeing yourself from it you're pointing an end to a relationship where you were not recognized, you were not appreciated. You could have been connected to a fire sign, doesn't have to be, but I am getting this energy of disconnecting, leaving this all behind, leaving that sadness that's associated with you being stuck in this connection as well. Leaving all that behind, putting an end to it, and being comfortable just being on your own and shining your unique light. That's what I see there, Libra. Some connected messages are coming through. Let's go ahead and uh, just pull some um, tarot for you and see what else we haven't covered, what else needs to come through, what else we did not see as yet. Let's see if we need We have an idol of materials. Of materials. Nice. Ten of materials in the world. Wow. Uh, there is growth, Libra, here in your finances. There's definitely growth here. There is expansion. Look at this. All these materials. This is all money cards. Ten of materials. That's financial abundance. And coming with the world, there is an expansion here. Some of you who are working on something connected to internet here, I do feel that you're going to have a lot of success. But there is a need here of some sort of change of perspective. Maybe you're going a little bit and slightly in a different direction here. I feel like you're uh, you've been going through a, um, an energy.
strategy here where you had to be very careful with your savings where you had to be very careful with your budget in here and maybe you were even holding on to what you had a little bit too much I feel like changing of perspective is very uh, very important here and you are moving into a direction to, towards more financial abundance some of you will explore in um, a different niche um, it's connected to the either business or the work that you do but it's slightly different I'm getting a slight shift here an expansion in a little bit of a different direction that will allow you to grow and will allow you to almost kind of fill the niche that maybe is less competitive and that's where you're gonna see a lot of success some of you it's a market that uh, it's a different market it's a and maybe even an international market here. Some of you need to target a different market here. That's what I'm getting. I feel like you will be on exploration here and I feel like this is gonna be a lot of thought that's gonna be put in here. Um, a lot of thoughts, a little bit of a different perspective, a little bit of a shift or how you do the business here and that's how you're gonna see success. This is what I see, Libra. These are the messages that came through today. I truly hope this reading was helpful. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. And I hope to talk to you soon. Bye for now.